try to take care of your little space right here. The human mind can know all kinds of things, huge things. It can know all the way out to the universe, all the way back to almost to the Big Bang. And there's so little that we can actually control, and there's a lot of suffering that comes from that if you're not careful. You can see all the suffering of the world, and it can get overwhelming. But think about what the Buddha did. He saw beings dying and being reborn in line with the karma. In a lot of cases, it was not a pretty sight. It's very few people who get to be reborn as devas and human beings, and an awful lot that go to the lower realms. And so he did the best thing, which is to get himself out of that and to show other people that they can get themselves out too. That's his best gift. And they say that he could have been a king, he could have been an emperor. And kings and emperors have a lot of power, but not nearly as much power as a Buddha, because they can reign. Kings and emperors reign for only a short period of time. And who knows exactly how much they can actually affect in, in terms of changing things. And then it gets wiped out. You can think of King Ashoka. He could see as he was dying that his heirs were not going to be able to maintain the goodness he had tried to establish. But the Buddha had something better than just ordinary goodness. It was greatness. Total release available to all those who want it, if you work at it. And in showing the way, and showing that this was the best way, that was his best gift to the world. So when you think of all the things you can't change, like this wind out here, who knows how much longer it's going to blow and how much damage it's going to do, what can you do? You take shelter, and then when the wind is over, then you come out and check out what can be done. And in the meantime, you've got to develop a lot of equanimity. Well, the winds of the world are even bigger than this wind. There's war, there's disease, there's all kinds of horrible things happening out there. And the best thing we can do is find the way out and show others that this is, there is this way out, so they can take advantage of it too. That way you keep your priorities straight and you focus your attention on what really can be done, the most effective things that can be done, the best things, most compassionate things that can be done. And don't let your time and energy be wasted with things that you, you can't control. There's a lot we can know, but there's very little we control, so you can focus on what you can control and make the best of that. Because that actually leads to a, leads to a freedom that's even bigger than the winds of the world. <laughs>